Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel. Today let's visit the southern part of Portugal where all the beautiful beaches are located. So why delay? Let's go and explore and please don't forget to like, share, subscribe and press the bell icon so you don't miss any of the notifications. So we are going from Porto that is the northern part of Portugal to all the way to the south Algarve which is in Fargo district. So from, far, from Algarve we are going to Lagos that is where all the beautiful beaches are located which is around our drive. So we rented a vehicle in Porto and uh, we used uh, this rented vehicle for all our traveling in Portugal. The drive from Porto to Algarve was very scenic, very beautiful and very calm and quiet with lot of green lands, green lands and lot of uh, like sheep, cows and all. And also the main thing they grow here is olives, oranges and also grapes as winery is very big in Portugal. We see lot of these trees on the way and uh, it's very thinly populated some locations are but uh, the views are spectacular. On the way to Algarve, we stopped in one of the place called Marvo. Uh, it is a very beautiful city and also it has a castle. We wanted to see the castle but uh, while driving uphill somehow we missed the route and uh, there was no internet connection also so we couldn't able to see the castle but the town itself is beautiful and they every house backyard has an orange tree here so we reached Algarve at the night so this is we booked the beach front hotel so this is the view from the hotel next day we traveled all the way to Labos which is like a all half an hour drive from Algarve so Labos is the place where the Benajil cave is uh, it is one of the must see attraction in Portugal. For this we had to go either in kayak or speedboat. So all the shores are all limestones. So you can hike either on top of the top also or you can come and enjoy the beach. So this is where you rent, buy a ticket. Uh, this is kayaking, this orange and uh, yellow one. Uh, this is where you can go inside, stop, get out of the kayak and enjoy the view. Uh, the speedboat, the big one, yellow and blue, where they take near the cave, but you cannot get down. So many people rented the kayaking and doing the kayaking to Benajil cave. These are all limestone. We rented the speedboat and we are going to see the Benajil cave. The people are very friendly, very helpful. This is sentence to Benajil. This is the Microsoft screensaver. So the beautiful screensaver is from this area. So we are going inside the Benajil cave. See the kayak people are going, getting down and enjoying the view. Uh, but uh, with the speedboat, we can't get down. They stop us here for almost a minute. So for the cave, there is an opening uh, in the top. 
and also there are openings in the side also since it is a limestone it is kind of brittle so with the water waves with the force it keeps carving and making all these beautiful structures we are getting out of the benagil cave they are taking us around the coastal showing some of the beautiful spots these beaches uh, they were saying uh, the exit and entrance to these beaches are only through the ocean few companies host the parties here uh, and see here is a sculpt sculpture of a person you can see face nose hair and all there is one more beach here where the entrance exit is only through the ocean so there are few beaches like this and uh, here is another cave where you know it goes deep inside and uh, they were saying it is the a uh, lot of uh, squid and octopus they come here to collect it and also many birds are made their nest around this area because of the food when the sunlight falls it 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 becomes like a golden color so it looks very pretty this is another place for where plenty of squids and octopuses are available you can see in the when the tides are high it reaches till the you can see the different color on the limestone it reaches till that height there is another sculpture that it looks like a crocodile all the way on the top and this one looks like a elephant so like this there are limestone has formed different structures this view is really gorgeous so uh, there are so many beaches are also small big like that on the shore and this single structure has a lot of birds there's small small beaches here this is another place in labos with a beautiful view uh, we went on top for the hiking also it looks like a heaven on earth this labos and lagos has not only best beaches in portugal they have the best beaches in the world too it looks so picture perfect we went in the month of december so since it is the southern part of uh, portugal weather was much better it was uh, during day time it was in 60 65 degree fahrenheit so we found in the nearest bakery there was like a nice interesting desserts it 
like all made in the shape of birds fruits it tasted like our kaju katli so in the the limestone you can see it looks so brittle and it has so many seashells uh, very rich in calcium content and uh, on the shore with the tides they carved so many like small small cave like structures have formed especially this one it looks so narrow but if you crawl and go inside it opens up like like a banajil cave with the opening in the top so all interesting structures have formed in this area this is all part of labos and lagos labos is where the banajil cave is so these are all mainly part of lagos they are all kind of connected to one another in few of the areas we hiked also but we had to be little bit careful while hike, hiking because the sand will be little bit slippery from every point the view is so pretty some area they made these stairs to go all the way down to the beach this is lagos the view is just breathtaking you can rent a boat and go inside that cave that where the door kind of thing even these greens were like very very pure green it looks so pretty actually we rented a boat here and went all across actually people were walking from one one structure to the another one like that so water is not too deep in this area but in the evening time the water level increases we were hiking here hola portugal it's such a pleasure weather to hike and uh, while driving we found few orange trees on the side of the road only so you can see so many oranges these were not the best oranges but uh, they were not bad though but in the garden uh, of the in the backyard of the houses they grow the best oranges this is another beach next to lagos this is almost like a private beach i can say though it is not private because as there were barely any people we hiked little bit and went all the way down uh, we had to climb around uh, i think uh, 200 to 250 stairs to reach the down but it was worth doing it because as these beaches are gorgeous it is like a once in a lifetime opportunity so hope you all like this one and uh, enjoyed this logos and please don't forget to like share and subscribe my channel 
and as always everyone be happy be healthy and be safe take care